It's time to dive into this week seven matchup between Georgia and Vandy. I just got a feeling in my damn plums. This is the weekend that Georgia really damn cuts loose. All right, they they obviously beat the piss out of Auburn last week. It was close at the half. Offense looked pretty damn bad. They are struggling with that AD Mitchell, but um, I think they're going to absolutely run all over Vandy. I don't see Vandy scoring any more than ten points, and I see the dogs putting up like a, like a damn fifty two spot, fifty five spot. So uh, I think it's going to be a similar score to the Bama Vanderbilt game. Now listen. I ain't damn touching it. I bet on Georgia twice in the last two weeks. I've lost both, and those are my only two losses in college football. Knock on wood. Um, I do lean Georgia minus 38 and a half. I would not take them first half because in the first half in the last, like, hell, three weeks, four weeks, they've looked damn terrible. They've looked piss poor. Um, full game, they're just going to be too much uh, for Vandy to be able to handle them. So, uh, full game, I don't hate. Uh, the 38 or the 38 and a half, whatever that un- number is now. Um, but again, I'm laying off. I ain't touching it because in the last two weeks, they're my only two losses, and there ain't no way in damn hell I'm touching them. That first half spread is massive. I think you'd be damn nuts to take Georgia minus 24 and a half, to be honest. Um, we saw Vandy last week. They were up on Ole Miss at the half. Now, obviously, Georgia's better than Ole Miss, but my best advice, lay off. If you got to play anything, I'd play Georgia full game. Get your damn mind right. Let's have a damn week seven, log it in. Let's ride.